In this video, I'm going to explain about OSnap or Object Snap in AutoCAD. So where can we find the settings for OSnap? Or what is OSnap? So when I click on my line tool here and then I hit Escape, and if I want to create a line from here, and I'm going to move it to the to the mid, to the you know to the close to the endpoint, what it does it there's like an orange square that lights up and and then a toolbox I mean a tooltip will show that that's the endpoint. So that is actually controlled by OSnap or Object Snap. Now, where would you get that options or where would you control the settings? The settings would be in the status bar here. If you right mouse click an object snap, so that's object snap. And then here you can see uh, right now in my settings, it snaps with end, every endpoint, midpoint, center, perpendicular. Okay. And if you really want to control the settings, you click on settings here. And then you can clear all and you can select all, but it's not a good, good idea to select all because if you're gonna do select all, everything would snap to all the points that's in the settings here. So I'm just gonna clear all. You just use the end, you just use the snap modes or the object snap settings on demand. Like if you want an endpoint, just put endpoint. So right now I'm gonna click on endpoint. It's gonna snap to any endpoint, center, midpoint, quadrant okay so that's fine so now in this uh, in the left side of the check mark those are the the icons that, that will light up once it's close to that point okay I'm going to click OK here and then let's start drawing so I'm gonna have a rectangle here and I'm clicking on my line tool and I'm going to close, go close to my endpoint, which is this one here. And then let's say I want to go to the midpoint of this line. So the endpoint lights up and if I go close to the midpoint, it's going to show the midpoint, which is the triangular icon. So I click that and go back to this endpoint here. Hit escape. Then I'm going to do it the same way here. So I'm going to find the mid end midpoint and then midpoint here, midpoint there, midpoint there. I'm going to close that. Escape. Now for center, it's the same thing. So when I click on circle, I can click circle there. And let's say I'm going to put a line from here going to the center of the circle. I'm just going to go close to the circle. And then it shows me the circle, which is the center. So I click there and it escape. Now, let's go to Quadrant. I'm just going to move this down here. So it snaps to Quadrant. So I'm just going to check here. It snaps to Quadrant of a circle. So I'm going to cl click on Line here, and I'm going to look for the Quadrant. So that's one Quadrant. This is one Quadrant. So I'm going to click there. And now that's the Snap to the Quadrant. So how do you... Let's say you want to... To remove the snap modes, you can always deactivate all the snap nodes by by clicking on this icon here. Because right now the object snap is turned on, that's why it has like a bluish color, and to say it's active. So if I remove that, and then I'm gonna make lines here, nothing will snap. If you notice, there's no snapping because I turned off the object snap. 